Where's the baggage cart? Here he is! There we go, the baggage cart is working. Yeah, the baggage carousel's working. And they're picking up their bags. Hello guys and welcome back to the next episode of Sim Airport with me Biffa. Thank you very much for joining me. Great to see you again. So we had a successful flight last time, although the passenger satisfaction went down. They were waiting a long time here. Now, from what I can gather, from what I could see, it was to do with the baggage handling. So we are going to try and get that set up now. So we have the baggage routing station last time. There was little golf buggies that would appear here and take all the baggage all the way through here, there, come back, get some more but you can have an underground conveyor line which is fantastic so we are going to add let's come out of that menu a baggage routing station provides a hub for tarmac workers to and remove baggage from the conveyor network outdoors only must be placed in a secure area i'm assuming this is going to be secure it lets us place it here uh, this to me seems like it could be a good spot because this is where the let's rotate that let's have a look this is where the golf carts were going with the items i'm not quite sure which way round that really needs to face that looks like it's the where it comes down like that no hang on like that that looks like the out part of it so if we have it like there like that Yep, and then we can add the conveyor lines from here to here and then from here to here. And hopefully that will work. So, I mean, let's... Okay, that's going to just go across there like that. Okay, does something have to go straight? And then do we just connect that to here. <laughs> there's no, like, connect... Oh, it's not been built yet, is it? So that's probably why there's... Cancel that. Yeah, let's do that. I'm assuming then we can just add these to go onto there. Okay, let's get the games going. Let's speed it up. And then when this is done, I bet there's a connection we can do to there. And we're going to have the same here as well. This underground baggage is going to come along here. Yep, and then we'll root. Oh, there we go. Look. Right, let's just read what this says here. Requires, let's slow that down. Requires an adjacent road or taxiway. Oh, well, what's this here? <laughs> Airplane gates. Okay, hang on. Pause, everybody, pause. Requires connection to ticketing desk via conveyor network. Well, we can do that. Baggage carousel, yeah, we can do that. At least one functional hangar with a baggage car. Well, we've got that. Airplane gates. Oh, we don't have a hangar. Oh, that's like a whole separate thing, isn't it? Oh. Oh, whoa, whoa. Okay. Well, it would have been nice if it had told us that before we made it. Does it actually say that on there? A hub? No, it doesn't. Okay. Well, there we go. We've learned something there. Um, hangers. Medium hangar. Small hangar. Five units of steel. Zero in stock. 10 units of asphalt, zero in stock. It's got one vehicle spot. Okay. So does this actually need one functional hangar? It doesn't need to be in a hangar. Okay. Must be placed facing a taxiway or road. Like that. Why is that? allow me to do it there but not there i mean this is the, i know this is the taxiway this is where it taxis why is it going there and then that needs to be next to a road so maybe that needs to go there as well let's try it let's see we don't know we're learning so let's put let's put that face in there yep you can get building with that hopefully i don't know whether the stuff is going to come into stock just automatically or there doesn't seem to be anything to do with, like, buying products. <laughs> so, I'm assuming they're just going to turn up. Um, Finance-related utilities, bank reports, lower taxes, okay. Operations, chief operation officer, what does he do? Road building, bank loans, multi-lane access. Let's do this one here. Operations research. Hire a COO. He's going to need an office as well. So, um, Package cars out. Adjacent road or taxiway. I think that might need to go up here. So, I'll tell you what we're going to do. is We're going to destroy that. 
And we're going to put another one in. Up here. Oh, blocked by near ground. <laughs> nearby underground conveyor. Darn it. I'll put it over here. I mean, they're still going to go backwards and forwards. No, I'll tell you what we're going to do. Stop. We are going to cancel that. Yep. That should hopefully get done. We've already cancelled this. Right click for construction options. Yeah, pending delete. Okay, that's fine. Mm, I was hoping to get this done. What have we got down here? Are they picking up stuff? We've got stuff being delivered. Delivery. What is this? Decorative bush, conveyors, decorative bush, paint. Yes, the stuff's coming in. Oh, that was paint. There wasn't any steel. I don't know whether this is going to work, you know. Let's let's see. Okay. Oh, yeah, there we go. Yep, they're doing it. Good. Okay. Has this underground conveyor been changed? I want to get rid of that. Because I want to put that in. Although, why doesn't it let me go there? Because that isn't as close. There's space here. That's weird. Oh, he's done it. He's taking it away. Nope. Still won't let me place it. <laughs> what? Block by near ground. It won't let me place it up here. Okay, it's going to go over here then. I don't care. I just want it built. Let's put it next to there. And let's get our... When that gets built, we'll put our conveyor line. We've got this one coming here. Are they still building this one? It's just taking a while, isn't it? They built this bit. So it's going to end up coming up here somewhere. Let's speed things up. I wanted to get this done before the next load of... Uh, what are these guys? Oh, supply trucks. Man, the money's going down. Satisfaction's going down, but, you know, there's nobody here, is there? <laughs> oh, there's a few... Oh, no, these are just workers. What are these guys waiting for here? Boredom. Bladder. Hunger. Rest. Oh, so in this area here, while they're waiting... We need some areas where they can get food and <laughs> relax a bit. Um, let's maybe put some benches here. Like this. There we go. Uh, we'll get some decorative bushes. We'll have that colour that side. We'll have this colour this side. That's it. So if you get one of these seats here, right next to a bush, nobody can cut through right next to you. You'll be a lot happier. Let's get a coffee maker. I'm going to put a coffee maker there, and I'm going to have backed up against it. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Want some more food stuff. A drinks machine. There we go. And then we're going to have some food vending here. Yep, that way. And what can we put behind that? Maybe another food vendor. Oh, security exit. A secure area boundary allows passengers to transition to non-secure areas. Ah, let's put another food thing there. They'll get that done. They'll have somewhere to sit down, hopefully. Has this been finished? It has. Okay, let's get conveyor line. So coming in to there. Yep, okay. And then leaving... I'm assuming it's going to have to sort of go around the back. Oh, you can't go around corners. You have to do that. Okay. Let's see how that goes. Hopefully that works. Is this going to give me other... One functional hanger with a hanger with a baggage car. It's functional. Assign vehicles. Slot one adds a baggage car. Hey, there we go. Ooh, that costs a lot of money. We're running out of money. <laughs> We're seriously running out of money. Whoops. It's night time. I was going to try... Right, let's have a look. So these are done. These guys are still not happy. Oh, I've just blocked the restroom door. <laughs> let's destroy this bush so people can get in and out of the toilet. Sorry, everybody. Didn't mean to do that. I don't know why they just sort of stood in here unless they are waiting for a flight. They need information as well, of course. So let's put in 
one of those information flight info displays. Seems like it faced both ways. We'll sort of put that there. So anybody sit here, sat here, can look over there. Uh, what have we got here? Ticketing kiosk, ATMs. Okay, we seem to have everything we need in that area. Conveyor lines. Yep, everything's connected. It's functional. Excellent. So tomorrow, when all the carts and things come in. There we go. I also thought we need another one of these down here because there seem to be a lot of people standing around wanting flight information. That seems to look the same whichever way it's facing, so we'll just do that. Okay. We're going to need an office at some point, aren't we, because of this research. Oh, operations is complete. Ability to hire a COO. Okay. But is he going to need an office? I bet he is. Let's see. We've got some spaces up here. Would seem like a good place to build an office. Let's try that. Let's let's see. Let's see. So objects. Um, I want to build a wall. I can't remember where the walls were. Mm -hmm. Build. Wall. There we go. Right. So we can have like a an office block. Cannot be outdoors. Okay. Foundation requires one or more. Makes an area indoors by paving concrete surrounding it with walls. Oh, okay. Decorative floor. Let's go for the foundation then. Oh, man. This is going to get expensive quick. Um, let's cancel that. I want it in the middle here. Okay. Let's go with that. We'll get them, we'll get them building that. And hopefully that will put walls around the outside. We can put a door. I'm thinking for a corridor. And then offices. A couple of offices over here. Something like that. Route vehicles to where they need to go. With sections of road. That's what this guy was needing. Needing to be by a road. So we could have actually run a road down here. And put that down here. But never mind. We're learning like we said. So let's look at our schedule. Oh there we go. Look they're building the foundation. Excellent. So at noon, we have the Aero Star arriving. As our satisfaction is going up. Oh, Aero time, 64%. I'm not sure I want another flight yet. I want to make sure we get one flight down and get that money coming in. Uh, let's speed up that. Get that done. Okay. We've got to finish this off here. We're going to have to put... I'm glad they don't rely on doors <laughs> to get in and out of their door. Can be placed on top of a wall used to separate different adjoining rooms. Passengers and staff can use this door. What other sorts of door do we get? We want just a, a staff door. Doesn't seem to be a staff door. Or anything particularly to separate. Okay, well, I'll tell you what. Let's put a normal door down. It's not going to be a sliding door. Oh, it's like put a wall there as well. Oh, that's annoying. Are you now trapped inside? <laughs> Let's demolish that. Can you work on demolishing that for me? And then I want to put a door in here. There. So if I demolish that and these... Yeah, hopefully that'll work. Oh, there we go. Yep. Working on it. Excellent. Oh, it's to remove the foundation as well. Well, that's annoying. Hmm. Okay, well, let's see how we go with this. We'll see if we can... <laughs> we'll see if we can work around it. Good. I can stick a door there. Uh, I want foundation here, though. But is that going to... Cause a problem. If I just put foundation there. Actually, it probably doesn't really matter. A decorative floor. Can I put... Can I be outdoors? So that's now counting as outdoors. <laughs> if I put a foundation along here, it's just going to stick a wall, isn't it? Let's see what happens. We're learning, we're learning. People are turning up. Here they go. I don't know why these people are still stuck here, but hey-ho. 89. Yes, that's what we want. Lots of satisfaction. While they're waiting, they can sit down and rest. 
The security is working. Let's speed up a bit and see what happens here. These little finickety things we're learning as we go, aren't we? And we want to see... Let's have a look. Conveyor line. Oh, look, there goes their baggage underground. It's whizzing along the conveyor belt. <gasps> That's fantastic. And it's going into here where it's being stored. Quick sip of tea. There it goes. All the baggage is going in to the baggage routing station. Oh, man, this should get flights going much quicker. Okay, this is under construction. Where am I? Oh, man, the passengers. Where are my builders, guys? Down here. Hmm. We may need to redo this. Oh, here we go. No, they're here. Yeah, okay. Pause. No, 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 no. Council. Council, council. Yeah, you're still building stuff that I don't want you to build. So I think what we may have to do is... Is demolish that. Um, demolish. Stop building. I've already said please stop. <laughs> demolish. Demolish. Block by pending construction. There is no pending construction. Uh, that's going to get destroyed. And then we'll build that in there. We'll come back to that. Let's see how this all goes. Everybody's happy. <laughs> Needs bladder. Come to the bladder shop. So the thing at the minute is rest. But there's plenty of rest available. And it's not full up. So it may just be the distance they have to walk. Perhaps. Did you go back into the body scanner? Why are you going round into the body scanner that way? It's facing the right way. Have <laughs> I got it facing the wrong way? Let's destroy the body scanner. And then we can turn that around. No, no, it says in there, no. Okay, let... Hmm. I can't cancel a destroyed option. It won't let me do it. That's weird. It's definitely facing the wrong way, though, isn't it? Look. So that arrow is incorrect. <laughs> I think once we've done this scan here, we should be okay. So, what time? It's 11.53. The plane will be turning up at noon. So, not long to go. Three minutes. And then we'll see how the baggage goes. Does it show you how much is being stored? No, it doesn't. But I love seeing the baggage coming under line. Here it comes. It's coming in hot. Let's close that so we don't actually destroy anything. Okay, you've got rid of that there. Are these guys just going to stand around now because they were queuing for that and it's been destroyed? <laughs> Is that going to be a problem? Let's see what happens. Yeah, this has all got a bit balky over here, isn't it? Clear. I want that to be destroyed. That to be destroyed. Please get on with it. Here's the plane. Boeing 707, 58 out of 100 standing, minus 104 en route. Not quite sure what that means, but it's interesting information. Let's see how the baggage loading goes this time. So everybody's waiting around. These people can't seem to get through because they they seem to. I thought that was they seem to be waiting for a body scan. Okay, everybody's coming off. A body scan that is never going to come. <laughs> um, let's put it back in then and see what happens. We may, we may have messed that up. Wow, look at all the people leaving. Lots of people leaving. I feel like we need a door here so they don't go through all of that. Oh, there is a sliding door, but they're not using it. Okay. Where's the baggage cart? Here he is! There we go. The baggage cart is working. I need a screenshot of that. It's loading up. Can we click on the baggage cart? I have to wait until they come out. Ramp agent. There's no information about the ramp agent. There we go. You see? Oh, you've put the bags on there to come to the carousel. Is that bit? That's what's happening. Yes, look, you've unloaded all their bags. 
Oh, now we're going to have a proper working carousel. Are these all leaving without their bags? <laughs> I bet that's what's happening. Are they going to appear on here? Yeah, the baggage carousel's working. And they're picking up their bags. Nice. You're going to stand right in the middle. It's like the prime spot. You're still waiting. Oh, what's this? The baggage car is filling up. So hopefully now these guys and girls are not waiting so long. It's hard to tell. I mean, that's gone down a bit there. Yeah, this waiting thing here is the problem. I'm wondering whether we could change that by having more than one baggage cart. There he goes. He's going back into there. Click. Screenshot. Now we want to get these uh, three minutes, two minutes. Is that like starts as in is going to take off? No, here we go. They're boarding. Yes, the satisfaction goes down if they've got to wait. And I'm wondering whether... Okay, there's more baggage there. Anyone going to claim that? Yep. Good. Huh. I'm wondering whether that's to do with uh, waiting when they leave or waiting when they come in. I think that's what it is. We've got these people here. Ah! Oh, what's the matter? What's with the ah? Uh? Why are you unhappy? It doesn't say. Oh, they're taking... I don't know what's going on with her. She's stuck. She couldn't leave. Hmm. I think maybe that was facing the right way. Oh, here it goes. It's taking off. It's gone. <laughs> we probably got some money for that. Why are they unhappy with this? I still think this is like the wrong way around now, isn't it? Look. We're going to have to just destroy that and do without it, I think, for now. That, that went well. The baggage was certainly looked after, wasn't it? Which I think helps to speed things up. So maybe... I don't know whether having two of these would help. We can't assign any more cars, can we? We've only got one vehicle. One baggage car that we can assign. How's our bank balance? Okay, wages are going down. Daily cash flow estimates. There we go. Flight, we're getting 4,000. Staff expenses, 14,000. So we're gaining... I mean, shouldn't that be a loss? <laughs> shouldn't that be minus 10,000? We're getting income and outcome. So maybe we need to take on... Another flight. Oh, we can't sort it by interest. Oh, 69. Let's have a look at this one. So what have we got available? Oh, we've got quite a few available. Afternoon. So at the minute, we have a noon till 1. So we could take on a morning. 777. A big one. Why not? See how that goes. And then is there anybody that's got an evening? So morning, morning, afternoon, afternoon, night. Ah, oh, we need lights. Oh, okay. So I guess there's no evening. It's morning, afternoon, and night. Okay, I've looked through here and not found any lights, but we can actually upgrade our runway. Aha, uh -huh. runway ILS, instrument landing system for larger airliners, lights, or Papi, P-A-P-I, Position Approach Path Indicator. So let's get some lights. They just click over the... must be properly aligned with the runway. Okay. I'm assuming that that's the right way. Let's add those on and see. Now we have runway lights. Let's see if we can get... Who was the one with the nighttime flights? Morning, afternoon, night. Oh, okay, we need the lights built first. Let's speed things up, get those lights built. And we'll take on a night flight. Are my builders going to come up? Yeah, they're coming over here to work on those. There we go. Oh, passenger. Yeah, there we go. Look, I, I'm thinking that may have been, that should have been the other way around. But it never said. 767 Boeing, let's accept that. So let's have a look at our schedule. So we now have a morning, early morning, an afternoon, and a night. There we go. Someone's coming in. He's coming in this way, but the sound's in my left ear. Yes, he is. Is that because of the way I put the lights? I don't think it really matters, because they can get around both sides. 
Now, this is something worth looking at. Reports. Shows you what your secure areas are. Oh, we're still working on that. Your environment. So, the red is good environment. Environment items here. We don't have any up there. And then we've got some here. So, that cheers people up. Uh, the info heat map doesn't work. That seems to be mixed in with environment one. Because these seem to be giving off environment when that's really information. But that, you know, you can sort of look at that and still see. There we go. So, this here is giving off some environments as well. So we've got lots of people coming in and they're all stuck. <laughs> Why are they all stuck? Uh, okay, let's dump that. We're still trying to put a body scanner in here. <laughs> let's put it back the way it was, like that. And I don't know what all these people are doing. But they're not going to be happy there. All of these ones are leaving the plane. We've got a few waiting to go onto the plane. Overall, passenger satisfaction is okay. But I'm wondering whether this is going to start causing a problem. I don't know what they're doing. <laughs> Just standing around. Uh, this is still an issue. We may need to just destroy all of that and rebuild it again. I don't know. We'll see. The baggage handling is working well. Let's have a look at the conveyor lines. So he's taking all the baggage. He's going to drop it onto there. Let's speed things up. And there goes the baggage. Excellent. Oh my goodness. Look at the amount of people. Oh wow. That is tons. Satisfaction's still high though. Okay. They're using the restroom. We need another janitor. Look at all this. Um, yeah. You're going to go in there. There's two janitors in there. Can I move you to over here? I can fire you, but I can't move you. Okay. 40 minutes left for that plane. Oh, they're boarding. There we go. They're going on. Yep, excellent. Happiness is okay. I think, again, it's this waiting here. I'm wondering whether with a carousel we could have one for the stuff coming off and then one for the stuff coming on, and that would speed things up. What do you reckon? That would probably be it. But we've increased our income, hopefully. We're getting income of 19. That's more than our staff expenses. A total of 4,000. Zero cancellation, zero delay, zero flight missed. Yeah. I'm not quite sure what would happen if a flight was missed. So that's not a full flight. There's 15 minutes left. One en route. Zero en route they've got on. Okay. Let's close that down. I think that's working okay. And then our next schedule. So this is the early morning one. Uh, early morning one here. So the next one will be at noon. Right. So what's the matter with these people here? Did they miss their flights? I think that's what's happening with all of these guys here. But I think we're doing okay. We're now making money. These people seem to be unhappy. Oh, they've all gone from here. Look. So hopefully next time, now we've got this body scanner set up correctly again, <laughs> we won't get all the unhappy people that have missed their flights. <laughs> we shall see. We shall see how it goes with three flights, guys. Hit the big B with the tea stain to subscribe. Don't miss out on the next episode of Sim Airport coming up tomorrow. Any hints and tips you've got, let me know as well. I'll get to rebuilding this. We'll get our, we'll get our COO, COO. Yeah, we'll get him an office that he can work out of. I'll oh, we'll see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.